It gives me great pleasure to welcome you all to the opening of this beautiful structure today, our accessory ADU done in collaboration between Rice School of Architecture Construct and Avenue CDC. We started this project in fall of 2019 in Andrew Colopy's architecture studio. You know, the school has the construct program, which is our building workshop, and they work with um, local organizations like Avenue CDC. Avenue had this property and wanted to connect with Rice about building something on it. From there, the project went into construction documentation, uh, permitting, and then construction. It was for us an opportunity to take advantage of the, the land that we already own while also being able to add another affordable unit to someone in the community that you know we know <laughs> could use it. As a, as a developer, it's something you only wish could happen to you, right? It's not every day that you get to help a bunch of students build something like this. And it's untraditional and it's, it's something new. We like it because it's weird, but it's not, um, it's not out of place. I think that was a big part of the design, the materials that we chose, the color even, um, that it like really kind of gelled with this bright yellow house and this bright blue house and this bright green house that are all around us. It uses really similar materials, um, kind of similar scale, and but also something that's very contemporary, not kind of copying a historical style. It also, I really like that it takes something that is very low tech, the dog trot, where you just have kind of two volumes in the breezeway and that's a completely passive way to cool your house. It combines it with something that's very high tech, which is solar panels, to make something that is very efficient um, in a lot of different ways. Yay! <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> We'd love to see more. I mean, actually, historically, Houston, compared to many cities, actually has a pretty uh, long history with accessory dwellings. I would say we'd like to see more strategically a project where um, an ADU provides, you know, a space for someone to live who couldn't otherwise, like especially in this, you know, this context where we're working in historic fabric, right? Um, we're adding a place for somebody to live without tearing down something that's already important. I think an ADU is, can be really valuable in that way but it's one of the, it's only one strategy. So it's not a way to solve all of our kind of challenges in terms of density or, or sustainability, but it, it's, a, it's a tool that can be really useful in, in the right place.